the Tigers today, there is a little bit of rotation as Anas Zaruri comes back into the starting 11. Abdush Amor retains his place. John Michael Seri, Regan Slater in midfield with Jaden Filigy and Fabio Carvalho. There was some discussion that Alfie Jones might be missing today through injury, but those rumours have been quashed. As Louis Coyle, Greaves, Giles and Alsop complete the 11. Running through that then from back to front, Alsop in goal. Coyle, Jones, Greaves, Giles. Then in midfield, Seri Slater, Zaruri, Filigine and Abdush Amor with Fabio Carvalho. So Tyler Morton drops out of the team today. And then on the bench for the Tigers this afternoon, Eva Pandor, Sean McLaughlin, Matty Jacob, Cyrus Christie, Ozan Tufan, Adama Traore, Billy Sharp, Aaron Connolly, and as we've mentioned, Tyler Morton. James Justin down the line, well chested by Coyle in that right back position. Seri and Slater combined together. Slater wants to get the afterburners on and he's doing that. He's charging away from his marker. Slater towards the area. Was he pushed over? He was. It's a penalty. Six minutes in, Slater with a commanding run, a good 50 yards he travelled and Hull City have the first big moment of the game. But this is one of the biggest moments of the game. We're only seven minutes in. Fabio Cavallio right-footed. Oh, saved by Hermanson. Didn't find a corner. And the biggest chance that Hull City might get this afternoon has to pass them. Plays now towards Regan Slater. Infield to Greaves in an inverted full-back position. Won by Leicester. They've pounced on it really quickly. Here's Atkin. He's blazed it over the top. But Greaves this time, the one losing the ball in midfield. Yes, they haven't lost it too many times there, Hull City, but the ferocity of the press and then the speed to get themselves into a good area to shoot Leicester City there to see. Today's referee, Samuel Barrott, who had Leicester City twice so far this season. Both 1-1 draws at Sheffield Wednesday and at Ipswich Town as Fars has given the ball away in an awful area. Carvalho! This time he scores the goal! It's Leicester's own doing. Their Belgian international comes up with the error. And Hull City have simply walked into the area and Carvalho makes up for his penalty miss and gets the MKM Stadium roaring again. But on the goal itself, it was a really poor moment in the back line from the Leicester defender. Vert Fars, Vardy on the other hand aggressive as he always is and he from 20 yards took the ball off Alfie Jones tried to get up ahead of speed went for a chip style shot only for it to drift wide of the target pressurising Ryan also now Jamie Vardy as Hull City try and work their way out Seri can't get the ball off Carvalho this time Dewsbury Hall, 20 yards out. Oh, taking the shot on, he's clattered the post. I don't know if Alsop got the faintest of touches, but if he did, what a smart save that was. But this game is not disappointing. We've had action and we've had moments already in these early stages. The Tigers leading by one goal to nil. Chowdhury with the ball in hand. He will throw it in for Tawu. Oh, he's gone over. He's given a penalty. And the Leicester player looked at so much like he'd gone down in a soft manner. And now it's Leicester's chance to level the scores up. Vardy has never scored against Hull City. And he has now, even though Allsop did his best. Jamie Vardy plonks it into the back of the net and the top scorer stares at the south stand takes in the anger from those there it's Hull City 1, Leicester City 1 what have they got in the bank here Leicester are they going to nab the lead before the break very nearly did as the ball was whipped in from the southwest corner Vestergaard leaping Vardy was close by too but goes glancing wide of the target on that occasion.
as Allsop has gone for a long ball forward, Carvalho can't bring it in, Farsi's header away from the box, is gathered by Seri, and now Zaruri! Hull City lead! And it's a moment of quality! With a blast into the right corner, and Hull City lead by two goals to one! So, Hull City have the game in their court once more. Leicester City immediately looking to respond. Great ball to Vardy. Vardy at the other end, 2-2. The lead lasted a minute. And that is what good teams do to you. They punish you in an instant. Straight from the kickoff. And Jones plays towards Seri as Hull City win it back in midfield. Carvalho to Philogene now. Momentum building again, the crowd pairing. Philogene 20 yards out, strikes into the clutches of the keeper. On target this time, the chance. Goalkeeper watched it well all the way. Leicester were getting numbers back as Slater now finds Abdush. He's swung it nicely out towards Arori. Perfect touch. Amor is courageously charging towards the penalty area. He's gone down in the box as well. In an accidental coming together. And a ricochet now. He gone, <laughs> goes for the acrobatic kick. But the offside flag had gone up. Put me off the moment. Didn't put Abdush off the moment. It's reset back to Chowdhury in the right back area playing wide now to Fatawu Fatawu to Chowdhury first time cross Coyle looks underneath it heads it into the deck Leicester City will regather with Fars and he's going to have a piercing shot from a way out 20 yards out tell you what he hit it well but it was off target and goes over the top of the crossbar 